the reasons for it getting worse, I, mean, I can only assume that people weren't following guidelines. Not everybody, but some people were not following guidelines. Um, we, we have seen a, a huge spike in our cases since Christmas. So I think we can all assume that um, family get-togethers at Christmas have been, um, you know, one of the reasons why our, our cases have gone up so much. It does annoy me slightly because we, lots of staff members are, are adhering to the, the policies, to the guidelines. We're trying really hard to socialize, to socially distance. Um, and then you've got people who refuse to believe this is real. We still have the element of people that don't believe. And, you know, I've had patients say to me, I wish I had listened. Um, I didn't listen. I didn't really believe it was real. So that, that's quite, um, you know, it's quite an eye-opener. The last few weeks have been extremely busy and challenging. Um, it's definitely different to the first uh, wave. Um, we've seen a lot more admissions with COVID-related symptoms. We've seen lots of um, groups of family members admitted with COVID. Um, a lot of young people, which we didn't see so much in the first wave. We've, we've had some extremely sick people. Um, you know, we've had lots of patients discussed with ITU, some transfer to ITU. Um, it's been, yeah, definitely it's been a lot more challenging.